Where's Astrid? Why do we keep... Well, that's right. Naked gorilla butt. I didn't even... I wasn't even going to go talk to him. Hello, and welcome back to my channel. So last night, I very unexpectedly, at the last minute, decided to do a stream. And I streamed a villager hunt for a dreamy for this island, which is Moonfrost, my formerly hard mode island that is now my surreal planet island. And I think I hit about 40 islands. I can't stream very long, which is one of the reasons I hadn't tried to stream up until now, but I streamed about an hour and 40 minutes, which isn't terrible. And like I said, hit about 40 islands, but did not find any of the dreamies that I was looking for, anyone on the list. And so I did continue to villager hunt using screen capture later that evening. And then I had to go to bed and then I got up this morning and did a little more villager hunting and managed to find one of the dreamies on the list. I was very excited. And so I wanted to share that as like an add on video to the stream from last night. So I'm going to let voice over me do the recap of uh, the rest of the villager hunt and uh, everyone can see what dreamy we found. So, uh, take it away, voiceover me. Hello, it's voiceover me, and let's do this villager hunt. Oh, we can already see that it's Kiki. She's so cute. It's kind of strange that she's behind the tree. Usually the trees move out of the way. Oh, Miranda. She is cute. She is very, very pink, but she is cute. Money Rock Island, and Azalea again! I found her during the stream. I mean, you know, I was tempted. She's good coloring for the island, but no. Not really alien enough. Freya, she's very pretty. I really, uh, I have come across so many wolves in this villager hunt. It's really making me want to do a wolf island someday. That's so funny. I, f I remember feeling like I couldn't find the villager, but I just saw him while <laughs> re-watching this. I saw his little feet behind the tree, but I was like, where's the villager? Where is he? But I saw who it was. It's a uh, hucker, right? Yeah. He'd be so great for a jungle island, prehistoric island, tropical-ish. Oh my gosh, Nox. Nox, really? So not right for this island. And another kangaroo. There were so many kangaroos during the stream, I feel like. And I kept getting repeats. Did we already have this kangaroo on the stream? Where's Astrid? Come on, she's the only one that fits. Shino. She's a great villager but not right for the island. Climbing, climbing. Who is it? <sighs> Another kangaroo. Marcy again. I, I swear we found her potentially two times during the stream. I can't even remember. It was at least once, but come on. Ham free. You know what? I paused for a minute because I was like, hmm, he's got the blue. He is kind of alien-y looking, but no. I decided no. Spike! I remember finding him on one of my um, other villager hunts that I had in my last video. He's definitely not the right color for the island. Mira! Hey Lisa, look, it's Mira! I remember you <laughs> saying that she was one of your favorites in the stream. She is cute. Not right for the island, but cute. And Kit again. Okay, I think this must be the third or fourth time for this villager hunt with the stream and this video combined. I mean, why? Where's Astrid? Why do we keep... Well, that's right. Naked gorilla butt. I didn't even... I wasn't even gonna go talk to him. I mean, I usually talk to them, but no. No, 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 no. Stella! I don't think I've ever had Stella, and she is actually very pretty. I like her a lot someday. Someday, Stella. But not today. Tank. Tank. He's cute, but he's no Hornsby. No rhino is Hornsby. I mean, seriously, Rooney? Rooney? Why are we not getting Astrid? 
Bengal. Okay, you know, I used to really dislike the tigers, but I think they're starting to grow on me because of Bianca. And Bengal is very cute. Not right for the island, but BAM AGAIN! I mean, he is so cute, but he really, really does look like an earthly, natural deer. He would not fit the island at all. Cookie, she is so cute. I mean, she's very pink, but she is so cute. But not right, obviously, for Moonfrost. Hippo! Hippo. What is it about him? Maybe it's his eyes. His eyes look too human-like. Another climby. Oh, Wolfgang again. The wolfy wolfies. I do really like his color. That's like one of my favorite colors of blue, like that deep turquoise. Oh, T-Bone. He's wearing one of my favorite shirts, though. I actually, I don't know if I realized that that was the shirt he wears. Hmm. Oh, it's a lion. Mott. Really? <sighs> Gonzo. I think we found Gonzo on the stream, right? <sighs> Alright, I had to uh, go to bed. <laughs> and then when I, I woke up early this morning when my kids were still asleep and started doing more villager hunting. And um, it was like evening on my Switch because I had started in the morning last night. And it's Rodney again! You know, I remember actually just being like... Is this ever even going to work? Should I just amiibo people in? I mean, this is just taking forever and I keep getting repeats of all the awfuls. And I was really feeling pretty discouraged. I really was. Yeah, see? I was like, nope, it's not going to- but then it happened! Look! Look at his little glowing robot eyes! It's Cephalobot! Yay! And you know something? I'm, I, I am not an octopus fan, and I haven't really been a robot fan, but now that I found him, he is actually super cute. I think that I really like him. I mean, he wouldn't work on a magical island, but he's perfect for Moonfrost, and he is cute. He kind of makes me like the octopuses. So yeah. Yay! Dreamy found. New appreciation for robots and octopuses. It's a win-win. And look, he even reacted to my reaction. That's pretty awesome. So back on my island, I went to double check because, you know, sometimes there's glitches. Just wanted to make sure he was actually moving in. Yay, he's moving in. And Isabel announced him the next morning, which was awesome. And I got the mush lamp so that he can become a proper permanent resident here. I went to say hi. Because that's the right thing to do. And you know, I should have known he'd have a really cool sci-fi interior because he's a robot, but I didn't know how cool it was. So I was really happy with that. Yep. I went headed out to place his mush lamp, and yeah, it's time to hand it on back to you, present me. And we're back! Yay! So, there you go. We got Cephalobot. We have the two robots that we want for this island. I'm very excited. And look, there's Daisy May wandering around. Let's go see what she is up to. Just for a second. I mean, I'm not going to buy turnips or anything. I want to see. She's walking on the little glowing path. So cute. Oh! And then she sneezes. on. Ugh. Okay. Yep. Back away, back away. Um, let's go see if Cephalobot is out and wandering, or is he in his house? I don't know. Judy's up there. No, sorry, that's Bianca. It is kind of funny how they get trapped up there. Poor villagers. <laughs> I think this is Cephalobot's house, yes. So let's see. He is home. Let's go say hi again. I haven't seen his house with the furniture. I just saw the wallpaper the day he moved in. We'll just go say hi really quick, and then I will wrap up this video. There he is. Look at this. What a cool house. I won't have to do anything with the inside of his house. I will do the outside because, like I said in one of my other videos, I want everyone's house to look the same. He's so cute. Hey there. Hey there, Cephalobot. <laughs> What's the latest? 
Just looking at the tent here, we've assembled here, Cephalobot and Lumi in one room. I wonder who'll play us in the inevitable film adaption. All right, he's a cutie. Okay, so yeah, that is it. Villager hunt is done. Well, I mean, one of many. I guess we have five villager hunts left. And I do want to finish this island by the end of May, so... Yeah, that's a tall order. We've got to find five more dreamies, and this one took 68 islands. 68 islands um, to find Cephalobot. And we have to find, whoa, five more dreamies. Um, one of whom I haven't even decided who it's going to be yet. So, yeah, that's, that's going to be a thing. That's going to be interesting. Anyway, so, yeah, I'm going to wrap up here. And, um, oh, oh, look, look. Um, Crispy Crafts gave me the great idea in a comment in my last video to put a crescent moon chair here in this spot that I couldn't figure out what to put and I think it looks awesome. So thank you so much Crispy Crafts. And um, yeah, so that looks great. Oh my gosh, she's going to come and sneeze on me. I'm going to run away. I'm going to run away. All right, anyway, that's it. This is the end of this video and I will be back. Um, I'm planning on making another video, hopefully in the next few days, um, doing another build on the island. If you look down at the map in the corner, that big area that's below the museum, I have a fun thing planned over there, and I will be doing a build video of it. So uh, keep an eye out for that. And also, I am going to try to announce my streams a little more in advance and do a better job of that, because I know I did it last minute. But I also was super nervous, and that was the only way I really could just get myself to do it. But... I am going to stream more villager hunts, so keep an eye out for that too. And yeah, I will catch you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!